Hey everybody, welcome back to Nems Plays E4. I'm here with Nems with Burger Crew Studios, and we are back in our Milan, the Ambrosian Republic campaign. Where uh, we have started to kind of block off the Italian peninsula a little bit. Uh, we will have to deal with the Pope at some point and uh, eventually turn on our friends in Ferrara. Uh, Genoa would be fun as well, but they are allied to the Papal States. Ferrara, or, Fla or Florence, is really just us and Savoy. So, yeah, that might be a thing. Meanwhile, though, uh, we still have the, uh, the Venetian menace that we're going to have to deal with. Um, let's check on some basics. This is, uh, I had to put a break into my normal recording session. So, um, election cycle, we got a 225. It looks like, mm, probably gonna not reelect this guy. Uh, Sporn spy detection is not a trait I'm too worried about, which is kind of an interesting thing with, with the elections and who you keep and who you don't keep, their personality traits will have a much bigger impact on uh, keeping people than just the, you know, do I want their particular point spread. Uh, meanwhile, uh, we can tech up on admin. Um, you know, economically, we're doing okay. Uh, I do have everything at full maintenance because we have uh, Ferrara and Separatists. I'm going to go ahead and unpause, but I'm going to back it down to speed three. Um, we do need more money. Corfu's building a spy network? Question mark. Sure, buddy. So three more years till we can go after Ferrara again and buy uh, proxy um, Venice. Ferdinand is reelected. The uh, the thing is about to kick though for Shadow uh, for the uh, the Italian states leaving the empire, which will include us. Which will cause some issues. It might also break the Genoese alliance, though, and that would be a big deal. Because if we're just fighting the Pope in Genoa, we may have a shot. Let me look at the Papal States. Um, is it Papal States or the... I think it's the... The Papal States. 12,000 troops, and then uh, Genoa has at least 1,300 on the mainland. Yeah, 13,000, I mean. All right. Um, who else? So we're allied to France. So let's make sure we are improving there. All right. Dropping things here. Um, all right. So the burgers get loyalty. Stability cost goes down. We get 10 years of happy populace. All right. That's good. All right, election. Do we want to keep this guy? I don't think we do. I think, um, I think I'm going to keep the military candidate. But uh, again, just to see if we can get some better traits and also to rebuild some of our tradition. Um, I don't mind tanking tradition a bit. I just don't want to tank it for the wrong guy. If that makes sense, uh, it's just not enough if they're okay. All right, so here's the thing. Um, so he's a free thinker. Idea cost minus 5%. That's awesome, actually. That stacks well. Um, what? Submission to the Emperor? We haven't picked. And we're... Milan's opinion of... Yeah, so the Empire doesn't concern us. Why would we get that thing? Hold on. I'm going to make sure... We didn't cling to the Holy Roman Empire. We've left it. Oh, that better go away. Or I'll be pissed. Stupid bugs. Do we want to lose some money? Let them gain influence and loyalty? Where are they at, influence and loyalty-wise? They're getting up there, but eh, that's fine. Alright, so we'll make a leader out of him. One, three, three, one. That's pretty good, actually. We do need to start building up to our force limit. All right, we've lost the effects of that. Good, good, good. I think it just goes, maybe it just goes until you make your choice. So we are no longer part of the HRE. The Italian states have left the HRE, which means a couple things. Uh, one, it means that, you know, the emperor might hate our guts now. Yep, they do. But the good news is we still have France on our side. Um... 
So I think everybody left. It looks like all the Italian states left. Yep, they sure did. Um, yeah, we own the wall stunt, so that's why that left. So uh, I'm going to hold off on that for now. When is our truce up with you? Uh, two years. And there's just the knights in for I'm tempted to go just straight after Venice next time. How are we on uh, favors with you? Not even close. Not even close. If we declare war on you, we'll get pretty much just Savoy. Um, how is Bohemia? Do we have favors with you? We do. So why wouldn't you right now? Is it just because I don't have a CB? No, we do. It's because of... Uh, war exhaustion. Okay, okay. Sienna, Ferrara, the Knights, the Nox. Yeah, I think if we had Bohemia and Savoy, I would feel pretty pretty good about that. All right. Do we want to gain three mercantilism and loyalty, or lose ten loyalty? Oh yeah, three mercantilism. Yes, please. Yes, please. Man, the event's just non-stop. Do we want to gain 60 Diplo power and make Venice happy? Or do we want to gain 2 Mercantilism? I'll gain 2 Mercantilism. Now, Mercantilism isn't what it once was in the sense that um, it does, I believe, impact the creation of corruption. But anyhow, our mercantilism is up to 15%, which gives us plus 30% trade power modifier per province and plus 7.5. So all that is very good. Very, very good. Burgers are extremely loyal, as they should be. Um, I could seek their support. And I probably will because I've got plenty of prestige right now. And then we'll call another Diet to get them happy again. Because I like lower land maintenance. Especially because we really need to expand our army. So I'm going to move you and see where these guys are. Because right now it's three and a half years. Let's see if I get off of there how long it'll be. 2.4 years. All right. So the first thing we're going to do is we're probably going to peel off at least some of the mercs. So let's create... Um, oh, we don't have any cannons yet? Yeah. All right, we're going to build some cannons. And then we're going to build a couple few. And we're going to be still trying to get our manpower up. We do need to start building a navy. Um, oh, our force limit. Uh, that's too high. Um, let's get rid of one of the tanks and... Or one of the tanks. One of the cannons. Two of the cannons, actually. <laughs> yeah, our force limit's only 20 right now. We will need to build some buildings to fix that. I'm going to go ahead and take the admin power or admin tech now, which will open another idea group. Which we'll have to think about what we want to do here. I'm tempted to just go trade right away, uh, you know, for, I don't know, money. Because in order to support some of these armies, we're going to need the money. And I feel like trade is going to be our path to financial freedom, uh, if that makes sense. Because as we hopefully move into uh, Flo or Ven Venice, in fact, I should probably check on something. Uh, no, let's look at this. So I consider, come on, I consider these. I, Venice is mine. Just, just hands off. Do you consider these your provinces? You do not. Do you? Do you? You do, but I don't care about you. So if I make Modena, uh, so I, I won't do that. They want you to know it too. Hmm. Well, I mean, we knew that the, the Florence uh, alliance was going to have to come to an end at some point. How are we on favors with you? So we'll use those favors before it gets too late. Savoy, doing fine there. France is going to come help Savoy with his rebels. That's good Good on you, France. Good man, France. All right, let's top off with Castile as well, because we will need their navy uh, at some point in the future, especially defensively. If um, 
if Venice or the Ottomans eventually become a threat, uh, the Castilian Navy will be very important. I'll have my voice back soon. I'm still getting over pneumonia, but um, uh, my cough is slowly going away. So for those of you who are like, man, you just sound rough. You're right. Um, and that'll end soon. Who wants Cremona? Oh, Venice. You know, silly, silly Venice. The real question is, do I take Mantua first or do I go straight after Venetian land? I'm kind of tempted to go straight after Venetian land. I have no aggressive expansion, really. I mean, it's pretty much all ticked off. Two or three. And, and by the time I declare war, that'll all be gone. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right. Let's check. How, how are we feeling diplomatically? We've got alliances with Bohemia, Castile, Savoy, and Florence. Uh, Genoa has claimed Luca. Hopefully I said that right this time. Luca. Um... Genoa. Hmm. Wonder if Austria would help you because I'm no longer in the uh, Empire, so they might be willing. Should probably go ahead and uh, improve my relations with Austria. Even though they hate me for unlawful territory and the waning imperial power, that will burn off by 2.6 a year. So it'll take 50 years to burn off completely, but uh, it is what it is. Are you... Um, Friends with Bohemia? You you are, so that shouldn't be a problem. I shouldn't say friends with, but... Um, Alright, so we got that. Do we not have another one queued up? I thought we did. Um, confused? Hmm... Um, no. Yeah, we're not we're not stealing cardinals. No, sir. Pope's not a fan of us. Mostly because we're allied to one of their rivals. Um, I'm going to wait and take the tech because I don't want to fall too far behind tech. Okay, so where's this other unit building? Uh, oh, he's probably building in Lucca. Luca. Um, yeah, that's exactly what's happening. We'll get rid of that, and then we'll just uh, queue it up here. I'll queue two up, and we're actually going to get rid of a Merc. Because uh, I do need... I, I do like some Mercs, especially when you have a country that has a decent amount of uh, money. But I don't want to overdo it. Manpower is still a resource we need to leverage. So I'll queue up a couple and we'll keep, I may keep at least four, but right now I think we have one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, we have six. I'd like to get that down to four or five. <coughs> Excuse me. All right. Mm -hmm. All right, truce with Corfu ended, Noxos, Ferrara, Venice. We can go to war again. And if I declare war on you directly, Bohemia, Savoy, and Florence will come in to aid us. And that might be plenty. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and... Um, oh, no, we're already embargoing them. Um... I mean, our other option is to go just after uh, this one. And that will get the Knights of Venice and Siena still. Um, which is really the same battle. I don't see any reason not to. But let's check out um, Venice uh, army first. And the problem with Venice is they can do Condottieri at a pretty good clip. But they're almost out of manpower. And they have 20,000 troops. Are they in another war right now? They are not. They're recovering. This might be the time. Because we almost have enough by ourselves. Sure, more mercantilism. Yes, please. Um, oh, our army reformer died. That's not good. Uh, more manpower. 
Probably should have taken the force limit, but that's fine. Not making a ton of money right now. And I would probably go into debt if I do this. Hmm. But I feel like I feel like now is the time. So, if we declare war directly on them, we can tape take Brescia. Um I would call in Florence, Savoy, and Bohemia. Screw it, let's do it. I mean, why not? We're gonna crush Ferrara's army immediately. I mean, the only major problem here is the tech disadvantage. Because they are on tech 8, and we are on tech 7. And let's go ahead and allow friendlies to attach. Uh, they're assaulting Siena. We may want to help them get rid of the Siena army. We're all going to fight. All right, pile in. Hope for the best. Palatinitan on our side. All right. That was a good battle. That was a good win. They're probably going go to go to, um, yeah, Venice now. All right, so we'll just start taking uh, taking stuff out. And I'm going to put um, at least one Merc down in Siena just so that we can, uh, just so that we can hold on to that. All right, there's Verona. Oh, really? I gotta go deal with Treviso first. All right, you guys can uh, all detach now. I don't think we need you right on our grill. I mean, you're welcome to come with us. Where'd the Venetians go? They're going somewhere. They've taken their army elsewhere. I'm not sure where. And I do not have the arm. I do not have a navy capable of really doing anything to them. So, <laughs> and we're already losing money. I am going to go ahead and uh, raise war taxes, just because I don't want to lose too much money. Oh, there they are. Where you going, buddy? Oh, they're sinking back up with each other. That's all right. I'm going to go take the war goal. Which is Brescia. Which is a core of mine, apparently. And look at that. It is a core. All right. They're heading up to Savoy. They're going to try to knock Savoy out of the war. Bohemia, if you want to go help smash those guys, though, feel free. I don't really want to attack them in Milan because it's just farmlands. <laughs> All right. How did the Palatinate get in here? Are you someone's vassal? Are you a Savoyan vassal, Palatinate? Oh my gosh, you are. Oh, personal union under Bohemia. Well, that's nice. <laughs> They're chasing after Florence, it looks like. Don't get caught, Florence, you, you moron. We'll have Modena siege down soon. That will allow Savoy to start moving around. Uh, once Bohemia frees up down there, that will be a huge deal. Because we outnumber them significantly, uh, but most of my allies are busy sieging town provinces. So there's that. And for some reason, Venice is hanging out in the Alps. They're like, hey, um, you know, fighting is hard, and we're, we're all into that kind of stuff. So, eh. 
All right, so let me check on some things here. Um, so for me to take Ferrara, um, oh, Florence. Yeah, that's not going to happen. So I'm just going to do war reps and money from them. Do I want to make them annul some treaties while we're here? Or end a rivalry? Uh, not really. Alright, so we'll get them out of the war. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to siege my capital down again. Sienna should fall now. Alright. Get them out of the war. Suggest demands. War reps and money. Right. Do I want them to end any of this? No, I don't think so. No, I'm fine with all that. Alright, so now it's just down to Venice and the Knights and his various allies. So Bohemia is free to come and assist. And by assist, I mean go home because they're black flagged. Alright, so let me look at this. Um, I do like the idea cost, so I think I'm going to keep this guy for now. And then we'll get 50 extra military power, which is fantastic, because now we're almost to Tech, uh, tech 8. Alright, they did breach my walls over there in uh, Milan, which is bad, so I'll need... Hopefully Bohemia can come back soon. Let's merge these guys up and allow friendlies to attach. Uh, I do think if I go in here, Savoy will help. And the good news is Milan is farmland, so shouldn't have any major issues there. I just need to finish this damn siege. Looks like Treviso not going too fast. Come on, finish. There we go. That's what I wanted. All right, now if I go in on Venice, will you guys help me? find out only one way to find out here comes Savoy hurry up Savoy I need those reinforcements we do have better uh, morale they do have better tactics I do think our reinforcements are gonna be uh, all it takes though man it is close we, we're gonna lose this nope nope we got more reinforcements thank God thank God and he's going north for some reason Let's chase him. Where are you going? Oh, are you going to Istria? What? Hold on. Why would I go? What? I don't understand this. Oh, it's a damn fort. No, can't do it. Nope, yep. Stupid fort pathing. I mean, they're going. I mean, good for you. Maybe I should just go over there with you. Oh, Bohemia was there. Ha 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 Where did you guys run? You must have run, like, way down here. Do we have access through uh, Turkey or Hungary? Oh, we gotta get out of there. Attrition. No thanks. All right, go ahead and un, uh, unattach to me. Yeah, we're going to bleed a lot of money and a lot of uh, ducats, unfortunately. So what am I going to take from you? I'd like to take that at minimum. Um, prefer to take more, though. So uh, that and that. I probably can't go that far. That's probably a bridge too far. Yeah, it is. But if I can take those two and uh, all your money and war reps. Um, that would be a good start. I mean, we're still a little ways away from there, but we're working on two forts right now. Because we're not going to get their capital. 
I'm pretty sure I could probably get access through Hungary, and that will allow my allies to get through. Mm -hmm. And I know this episode is running a little long, but I just want to finish up. Um, I just want to finish up. Uh, well, no, actually, it's a good place to put in a cut because. We, uh, we have two Ford Sieges that are going to take a little while. So I'm going to put a cut in here. Come back next episode as we hopefully continue kicking the snot out of Venice. Um, start taking his coastline, which is important. And then uh, I'm hopefully going to start building up my navy the more we start getting these coasts. And we'll eventually be able to deal with these uh, Phoenician jerks. Anyhow, if you guys are enjoying the series, please leave a like down below. More importantly, leave a comment. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you like. Let me know what you'd like me to do next. And uh, come back next time. See ya.